Welcome in to PFF TV. Austin Gale here with Mike Brenner, PFF's host of the Two for One Drafts podcast. We are continuing our draft profile series, talking a little Jerry Judy, one of my favorite players in this class, if not my favorite player in this class, because this dude can separate. He moves differently before and after the catch. I know you say that when you can move different at the receiver position, you have value. Talk, talk to me about Jerry Judy overall. Yeah, I mean, he won the Blitnikoff Award as a true sophomore at Alabama. Uh, came back this year, didn't quite you know, have as good a season as he maybe did his sophomore year, but then he goes to the bowl game against Michigan and reminds everyone, oh, hey, yeah, I'm a special sword receiver, goes for over 200 yards. I mean, he has deep speed that you can't coach, and he has route running ability that is just different from other, the way other wide receivers move. I got to talk the positives with this guy, specifically the pros with Jerry Judy. I'm sure it's a laundry list. This guy can separate. He's got ball skills, great after the catch. I mean, the, it, it, the list goes on and on. Yeah, it really does. And it's, the first thing you see, though, is his route running ability, the ability to set up uh, defensive backs, safeties, whoever it is guarding him, the ability to just utilize that special movement skills uh, to then create separation. He separates at the highest level of any receiver in college football right now. Yes, he has the majority of his work from the slot, but that is a special ability, again, that you cannot coach. And then he has speed. Uh, like I think he's probably going to run in the four threes wow. at the combine. He was running away from the safety from Ole Miss last year, who ran the fastest 40 of anyone at the combine. Uh, so I, I do believe Jerry Judy, while he's not the biggest receiver in the world, the pros are just go on and on and on. Very quick, has that long speed, great before and after the catch, and separation is king in today's NFL, and he's you know the best in this class at that. I'll just say it right now. If there are some cons in his game, though, some negatives you would pull in Jerry Judy, where would you find? Well, he's definitely undersized, mm -hmm. and he doesn't fit your sort of Julio Jones, A.J. Green, Calvin Johnson sort of prototype for what you want in a top five pick at the receiver position. Probably going to be under 200 pounds, uh, so he is slight. If a guy gets his hands on him, it can affect him more so than it might a bigger receiver. And then he hasn't done a lot of his work from the outside. He's going to be a lot from the slot there at Alabama. Hasn't necessarily been the focal point because they have so much talent around him at Alabama. So he hasn't needed to sort of produce on his own like some other wide receivers do in college football. But again, it's not saying he can't do it, it's just that he hasn't yet. I know this one's not going to be easy, but can you give me a player comp for Jerry Judy? And it's and one that's not God himself, you know, because <laughs> this, guy this guy's a talented, talented player. It is difficult, and I think the biggest thing uh, is just that the movement, it looks different than mm -hmm. other people. And so from that perspective, it reminds me of Odell Beckham Jr., where he just, the way he goes about his business, just other guys can't do that. Like other guys can, cannot run routes the way Odell Beckham Jr. does. So I, I, I think that's probably the best cop, but there's really no other guy I've seen that quite like Judy. It's the foot speed. I mean, yeah. Odell Beckham Jr.'s foot speed at his releases and in and out of his breaks, the route stem is just so similar to what Jerry Judy can do from a quickness standpoint. I couldn't agree with you more. Give me the bottom line. Jerry Judy in this year's draft. C.D. Lamb might be wide receiver one. He might be wide receiver one. First guy off the board, but give me the bottom line with Jerry. Bottom line is it's a deep wide receiving class, but do not pass on Jerry Judy. You will regret it. You want to get rid of me and get back to more great PFF YouTube content? All you have to do is push that button right there and subscribe. Thanks for watching.